Hey everyone and welcome back to another video. Today I just wanted to answer a common question that I have had lately. I'm sorry, I'm nursing. Um, how am I feeling? How's our little one doing? How are we? How have we been? Um, so I just want to answer these questions for you right now. So if you hear weird noises, I'm sorry, I'm nursing right now. She just woke up from a nap and she's not happy. So I am five months postpartum right now. It has been five months already since I gave birth to a little miracle girl. Uh, I, yeah, lots of people have asked, how have we been? How am I doing with my um, injury down there? My, uh, yeah, lady parts. <laughs> How have we been doing and how is the little one growing? So let's just start with myself. Um, I'm doing amazing. Everything has healed up very well and I cannot feel anything, no pain anymore, nothing is sore anymore. It, it, it just, it really looks great again. If you don't know my story, I will uh, link the video up here for you so you know what I'm talking about. Um, I, had, I had a really bad injury after giving birth. Everything really ripped really bad and I was not stitched up. So yeah, that's basically it. Um, and it took a long time for me to heal completely, but I'm totally healed. I can say I can do everything again. It doesn't feel weird or anything. My pelvic floor, of course, still has some um, exercising to do, I guess. <laughs> um, I'm in a fitness course that is called Mama Fitness, um, so it's fitness with baby. And I'm doing that once a week now, and I'm also doing exercises at home by myself. Um, but ever since I started that, I've noticed that my pelvic floor is getting tighter again and that it feels much better when I'm sneezing or laughing, that, I'm, that I don't have the feeling that everything is like falling out again. So that got much better and I think it's continuing to improve. Like everybody says, it takes nine months to be pregnant and have a baby and it will also take nine months for everything to go back to normal. So we are five months in and I'm already noticing that it is getting much, much better, but I guess we still have four more months to go until everything is completely fine again. My stretch marks um, are getting uh, less and less visible. You can still tell they're there, but they're not bothering me that much anymore, especially after people told me these are like my tiger stripes or these are drawings of my little daughter that she drew when she was still inside my womb as a sign that she was in there and uh, so I will remember all my life that she was my little miracle and I thought that it was a really nice thing to think about and so I'm not that bothered about them anymore. I actually did gain some weight I, like I lost all my pregnancy weight and now since I'm hungry due to nursing all the time I gained about well four kilos from my pre-pregnancy weight but after my pregnancy I went down to like I was one kilo away from my pre-pregnancy weight so from that weight I only gained three kilos but still I do notice it sometimes and but I don't want to get too worked up in numbers so I'm feeling healthy I'm feeling well and I always keep in mind that this is the weight that I'm using to nourish my baby because I'm still breastfeeding full-time which works fine and that's what I'm looking at instead of numbers and fitness and being small and stuff like that. I do not have any trouble nursing as you can tell. <laughs> um, I, am, I love nursing. It is a sweet time with my little baby. Uh, it doesn't hurt or anything. I do have something called vasospasms or something like that. I'm not even sure if that's the term for it, but I just read about it the other day because it's so cold in Germany right now. You saw my snow video last time. Um, right now it's not snowing, but it's freezing here. So and due to the cold, sometimes like the, um, the blood vessels in your nipples can like tighten up too fast and then they get really white and it kind of hurts. That happens right now quite often, but it's not due to nursing. Like it happens when she um, detaches and that can be kind of painful sometimes but it's it's not the worst and I'm it, it's fine <laughs> what else so yeah like I mentioned I did do the um, fitness right now so I'm feeling much fitter and stronger and which is great so I am overall doing really really good right now um, to my baby um, she is so big now she is rolling over back to front and front to back um, she's starting to sit up, like she can sit up by herself 
for quite a while now but we still have to watch her because after like a, a minute or so she will just like fall over because it's so ex um, exhausting for her she is still breastfeeding um, we since she is so interested in our food she always wants to grab everything that we eat and put it in her mouth due to the salt and spices in there we can't give it to her so um, we gave her a banana the other day and she was just like chewing on it all the time and she was so excited to have it and um, but then she got so hungry because it didn't fill her up and then she just got breastfed again because yeah she was so upset <laughs> but so so yeah she's starting to like get some foods just for the taste and the fun of it but she's not really eating it she's more like chewing on it um she is six about 68 centimeters long um and weighs about six thousand eight hundred grams she, I don't know about the sizes in the US, but in Germany she's wearing the size 74, which basically we have the sizes, which means how long the baby is. So the last size that she's just growing out of is 68. She's 68 centimeters, so now she's one size up. She is such a happy girl and everywhere she goes she's talking non-stop talking 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 and even in the mama fitness course we went in there and she was like talking the whole time and everybody looked at her she's like well she has a lot to talk about I was like yeah I guess she is just a Leo um just like her mom <laughs> talking non-stop and um even in the store, she's so loud. Everybody in the whole store can hear her how she's talking. And people, some people are always like smiling and happy, and, it's, and they think it's the cutest thing. And then like some people are like so annoyed by it. And I was like, well, she's talking. She's not talking like you, but she's talking. <laughs> um, so that's really fun. She's such a happy baby. She's so alert, and she just wants to do everything big kids do. So I don't know what else there is to update on when it comes to her, but so she's really healthy. I'm doing well. So that's my update for you that I have. Right now I am getting new hearing aids. That's why I hate hearing myself talk. I, I, to me, I sound like a robot right now. It will take a couple of weeks until everything is fixed with my hearing aids. Um, but next week I will probably finally do my whole hearing aid story how it came about that I have hearing it as at such a young age and yeah I will tell you my story in the next video so thank you guys so much for watching I hope you have a good day and I will see you guys soon bye bye